How to upgrade the BIOS to version 3.1 on Max Pro NVR PE Rev B. To create the bootable media needed to flash the BIOS, download a bootable USB creation tool. We recommend Rufus from Rufus.ie. The download is at the bottom of the page. Install and open Rufus. Insert your USB drive and be sure it's selected from the list at the top. For boot selection, select Free DOS and then click Start at the bottom. Rufus will warn you that all the data on your USB will be deleted. Click OK. This process should only take a minute or so to complete. Next, open the BIOS upgrade file zip and extract the contents directly to the root of the bootable USB drive you just created. The file structure should look similar to this when you're done. With the files in place, eject your USB drive and plug it into the PE unit and power it on or reboot it. At post, press F11 to boot to the boot manager. In the password box, type DVR4321 or RE1DVR as shown here and press enter. Select enter setup from the boot manager menu. Confirm on the main page that the BIOS is 2.2 or 1.5 here. On the boot tab, change the mode to legacy, then press F4 to save the changes and exit. On post, press F11 again, enter the password, and select your USB drive from the list. This will boot to the C prompt. At the command prompt, type AMI space X10SLQ.ROM and press enter to flash the BIOS. When the update completes, you'll see an A1 error at the bottom of your screen, which is safe to ignore. Shut down the NVR completely, pull power, hold the power button for 10 to 20 seconds, then reconnect the power cable and turn the unit on. On post, press F11 again, enter the password, select the Enter Setup option from the Boot Manager, and confirm on the main tab that the BIOS now shows version 3.1. Explore our trainings and discover your potential. Go to HoneywellDiscoverTraining.com.